Hello everyone, and welcome to the Car Crash Test Channel. Today we're diving into the Euro NCAP crash test results for two of 2024's most talked about electric vehicles, the Kia EV6 and the Volvo EC40. Both of these EVs have been designed with safety as a top priority, but which one offers better protection in a crash? Let's break down the data to find out. Starting with the Kia EV6, Euro NCAP's tests showed that its passenger compartment remained stable during the frontal offset test. Both the driver and front passenger received good protection to their knees and femurs, meaning occupants of different sizes and positions would be well protected in similar scenarios. However, protection of the driver's chest was rated as marginal due to the amount of chest deflection detected. The lower leg also scored marginally, showing that while the overall protection is solid, there's a bit of room for improvement in these areas. When it comes to rear passengers, the EV6 did a solid job, with the exception of chest protection for rear passengers, which was rated as adequate. Despite this, the EV6 performed exceptionally well in both side barrier and pole impact tests, scoring maximum points. These tests confirm that critical areas like the head, chest, and pelvis were well protected in side impacts. However, control of excursion, or the extent to which passengers are thrown to the other side of the car, was rated as marginal. Kia has integrated a countermeasure to prevent injuries caused by occupants colliding with each other during an impact, which performed well in tests. Whiplash protection in the front seats of the Kia EV6 was rated as good, while the rear seats showed only marginal protection based on a geometric analysis. Like most modern EVs, the Kia EV6 comes equipped with an advanced e-call system that automatically alerts emergency services after a crash and a post-crash braking system that helps prevent secondary collisions. Moving on to the Volvo EC40, Volvo's reputation for safety holds strong. In the frontal offset test, the EC40's passenger compartment remained stable and protection for all critical body areas of the driver and front passenger was rated as good, earning maximum points. This EV also offers excellent protection for different sized occupants sitting in varied positions. However, like the Kia, the EC40 showed only adequate protection for the chest of rear passengers in the frontal impact test. In both the side barrier and pole impact tests, the Volvo EC40 performed superbly, scoring maximum points across the board with good protection for all critical body areas. Unlike the Kia, the control of excursion in the EC40 was rated as adequate, giving it a slight edge in this regard. Volvo also includes a countermeasure to reduce injuries from occupant-to-occupant -occupant contact, which performed well during testing. One area where the Volvo EC40 outshines the Kia EV6 is whiplash protection. Both the front and rear seats in the EC40 were rated as offering good whiplash protection, providing comprehensive safety in the event of a rear-end collision. Similar to the Kia, the Volvo EC40 also features an advanced e-call system and automatic post-impact braking to prevent secondary collisions, ensuring a higher level of post-crash safety. In summary, both the Kia EV6 and Volvo EC40 are outstanding performers in Euro NCAP safety tests, but they cater to different strengths. The Kia EV6 delivers strong protection in side impacts and has an effective countermeasure against occupant-to-occupant -occupant injuries, though it could improve in areas like chest and lower leg protection. The Volvo EC40, on the other hand, excels with strong overall protection, especially in controlling excursion and whiplash safety, offering a more well-rounded safety package. When choosing between these two vehicles, it may come down to what you prioritize in a car's safety performance. If rear passenger safety and whiplash protection are key for you, the Volvo might be the better pick. However, if you're looking for a car that offers excellent side impact protection and good overall safety, the Kia EV6 won't disappoint. What do you think? Let us know in the comments which car you'd trust more to keep your family safe. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more comparisons and detailed reviews on the latest EVs.